um, where was I? Yeah, so, um, hopefully over the weekend, tomorrow's Saturday, um, hopefully I'm going to be doing some, maybe I'll do some cooking videos. I don't know what I'm going to make yet, but I know what I wanted to make over the holidays was, um, you know those little, um, oh, what are they called? Thumbprint cookies. And you make like little balls and then you push them down with your thumb, with your thumb and put um, jam in them. Well, I didn't make them over the holidays and I have been dying for them. And I just love that almondy, buttery flavor. And actually, I don't really need to have them in the house because with this bread that my husband's making and every morning he makes toast and all that stuff with it and or um, French toast or uh, I'll tell you my stomach is I swear I put on like two inches around my stomach during the Christmas holidays um, yeah so I'm gonna be hopefully I don't know if I don't do a baking video maybe I'll just do a cooking video um, but yeah um, I will be talking to you tomorrow and let's see what else did I want to tell you oh we got our TV back my husband got out on the roof he had this long pole and he put it, um, he put a, um, hot gun or whatever it's called, a heat gun, taped it on there with duct tape, had a long extension cord, rose it up on the roof, you know, with the handle while he was on the ladder, and propped it up against my satellite to melt off the ice. And it took about an hour to do it until he realized that he could have done the whole thing just by chipping the ice off. And it, he could have done it in like minutes. But I swear he does everything the hard way. Um, he's very smart, but when it comes to common sense things, um, I swear I could do it better myself. But um, anyways... It kept him out of my hair for a while, so it was good. <laughs> oh, the joys of having your husband around 24-7 when you're retired. I love him, but God bless him. Sometimes he drives me nuts. Um, not in a bad way. He's just, the things he does sometimes just really crack me up. Um, but we really, we don't bother each other. I mean, we can be in the house together all day long, and both of us, you know, can keep busy with our own stuff, so that's good. And sometimes we can go through a whole day without, you know, even talking to each other. I mean, other than, what do you want for supper, or, um, you know, what was that noise, or did you let the dog out, or, you know, just stuff like that. But it's funny, when the power was out, it's like after the second day, when you're with somebody 24-7, what the heck are you going to talk about, you know? It's just, it's funny. But anyways, it's a good thing we like each other because we would have killed each other with a whole week with no TV. A loaf of bread today. Actually, this one here came out pretty good. This is sourdough bread. And this is the loaf that he made yesterday. And I threw away the um, pecan and raisin loaf that he made. See, this is all the stuff that he's selling me for. Um, instant sourdough flavor. And then he's got his unbleached flour, King Arthur unbleached flour. And I know the thing of it behind me. And um, he's been throwing in the sour salt. Um, actually, it's, uh, he just put it in this container. Um, I had to go to the health food store and get... Um, citric acid and you could buy you know it's a powder and you can buy like you know as much as you want so I just got a little bag of it and he dumped it in this little container here but um he thinks he's Brett Betty Crocker lately I'll tell you he's driving me
me crazy, guys, with all this bread. Um, yeah, so I got dishes soaking in my sink here from supper. Um, <laughs> I was lazy tonight, and I just had, I made, um, in this skillet here, um, what the heck is it called? It was, oh, it was a hamburger helper. And I got the, I think it was, the heck was the name of it? I have to look in here and see. Um, hamburger helper, cheeseburger, macaroni. Um, actually, it wasn't too bad. And I have been eating the heck out of these things. They're those pizzales, 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 whatever they're called. The anise flavor. And they are so good. I love them with a cup of tea. So, anyways, it is almost 10 o'clock. And I think I'm going to be probably going to bed a little bit. I have to do my um, nebulizer for my asthma because, <coughs> excuse me, as you can hear, my lungs are like all junky tonight. I gotta open them up because I've been coughing a lot today. Um, so the bird is covered up in her cage and the dogs are in with my husband and Many, many blessings for the new year, for our health, love, peace, and prosperity to all of you. And thank you so much for your friendships and your comments and for subscribing. And I just want to let you know how much it means to me. And I love you all.